one practice question, binomial divided by a monomial, negative 6x squared minus 2x is your binomial, divided by the monomial of 2x. Let's see what it looks like two different ways. With an algebra model, I'm going to write down my template, and I'm going to start with my side of 2x, 1x, 2x. Now I have to figure out how I'm going to fit the area of negative 6x squared, so I'm just going to give a rough area, a non-constricted, non-defined area, and I'm going to start putting in my x squareds. If I put a line down here, I actually give two x squareds, then two more x squareds, then two more x squareds. I now have six x squareds. I'm not going to shade them in because they are negative, and therefore they don't need to be shaded in. And if I put a straight line down here, I now have my, I'm not shaded in, I now have my two negative x's. I can erase the rest of the superfluous lines that I put in. And I can now see that this side length that is now up here is going to be the quotient or the answer to the division of negative 6x squared minus 2x. If I just shade it in, that's going to be a negative x and a negative x and a negative x because a negative times a positive is a negative x squared. And this over here is going to be negative as well because a positive times a negative gave me this negative x. And therefore, my solution is negative 3x minus 1, or negative 3x minus 1 is my solution from algebra. If I reverse it and then say, okay, I'm going to use distributive property to solve it, so each term in my binomial must be divided by my monomial, I'm going to get two simple monomial divisions. The first one will be this, and the second one will be this. When I work that out, divide the coefficients, you get negative 3 over 1. Divide the variable terms, and x squared divided by an x, and x squared divided by an x, using my exponent laws, will just be x, giving me a negative 3 times an x over 1, or just negative 3x. And negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 1. x divided by x cancels each other out. I'm left with just a minus 1. And through distributive property, I still get the same answer.